Science TV with me, Esma. In a world where population growth is vital for many countries, a leader in Japan has made headlines with a shocking idea. Women should remove their uterus after turning 30. This suggestion has stirred up a worldwide of debate, leaving many confused and angry. Let's dive into what's happening. Here's a special report from Foresights TV. Yakuta, a Japanese lawmaker, is under fire for suggesting that women should have their uteruses removed at age 30 to encourage higher birth rates in Japan. In a YouTube video, he made this shocking claim while discussing the country's declining population and aging demographic. Yakuta also proposed banning marriages after age 25 and limiting women's access to university education, aiming to force early childbirth. His statements drew immediate criticism from women and various groups across Japan, leading him to issue an apology. He later described his remarks as a science fiction storyline intended to spark a conversation about Japan's birth rate issues. While he acknowledged that his views were extremely harsh, he retracted his earlier statements emphasizing that he did not genuinely support such extreme measures. Japan continues to struggle with growing fertility crisis, facing challenges linked to an aging workforce and declining population. Uterus removal proposal highlights a significant concern. Women deserve to make their choices about their own bodies. Connecting population growth solely to a medical procedure not only undermines women's rights but also oversimplifies a complex issue. Engaging in meaningful conversations about family policies and supporting women's choices could be the key to solving Japan's population woes. This moment is a reminder that solutions must respect individuals while also addressing national issues. Let's aim for a future where choices are celebrated, not mandated. That's all for today. Thanks for watching Foresight TV with me, Isma.